Right now we're in Kelowna at the El Dorado Marina. So far, zebra and quagga mussels have not found uh, a home in British Columbia, but we need to keep it that way. It's going to take the work of multiple ministries and multiple agencies. Today we're announcing an investment of $1.3 million from uh, Ministry of Agriculture, Forest Lands, Natural Resource Operations, Environment and the Ministry of Transportation, as well as BC Hydro. A great example of how, how we can work across government because collectively we all recognize how uh, serious this uh, risk is, how what the potential uh, negative impact to our economy here in the Okanagan and across the province if it got introduced. So we need to make sure that we continue to remain vigilant and uh, provide those additional resources for that early detection. They will uh, you know, work to uh, infest themselves in, in all our systems that, uh, that touch uh, fresh water. So it's, uh, it's better to prevent than to cure, like uh, we all know. Uh, prevention requires action and today we continue that action. We ask them to clean, drain and dry your, their boat, meaning they clean all mud, plant, debris, anything that's attached to the boat hull um, off the boat. Um, then they drain the boat, meaning they pull the boat plug, they drain the life wells, they, they get the water out of the engine cooling system as much as they can and then they finally dry it off meaning they remove any standing water with cloths, etc., whatever they can do um, to get all water out of the bottom of the boat and let it completely dry out. And that will address most aquatic invasive species and stop them being spread by, by those boats.